Hey, what's up everyone? Sam here. So in this list, I'm going to be showing you five crazy non-lethal weapons. Number five, tactical pens. How can a pen be an effective weapon? Well, these tactical pens are a little bit more upgraded than your typical biro ballpoint. They're fitted with spiky metal tips and a blunt side. They also work as normal pens too. The idea is pretty simple. You keep it on your person like a normal pen, and should you find yourself in a self-defense situation, you can pull it out and take a few sharp jabs at your attacker. While they don't look particularly dangerous, if you jab just right and with enough force, it can cause some serious damage. After all, the sharp metal tips will pierce the skin just like a knife. This should be enough to disable an unarmed attacker and give you an edge in the right situation. Number 4. Sticky Foam Gun This weapon may look ridiculous, but believe it or not, they are actually quite effective. Essentially, this foam gun shoots out a sticky foam at its target. The foam very quickly hardens and traps the target. It's actually a very good idea, but they did have their issues. They were used in the mid-90s in the US intervention in Somalia. They were meant to be non-lethal, but if the foam covered someone's face, they could quite easily suffocate and die. The second problem was that getting someone out of the foam took hours. So while it did work well in stopping someone and rendering them useless, getting them out of the foam is even more of a headache. Because of these problems, the sticky foam gun stopped being used. Number 3. The Thunder Generator Even the name of this weapon sounds pretty damn crazy. It wasn't originally designed to be a weapon. Instead, it was created by Israeli farmers to scare away crop-eating birds. However, it was soon recognized to be useful against humans too. Essentially, this weapon can shoot out loads of short shockwaves up to 100 meters away. These shockwaves are so powerful they can knock down and stun a person. However, if the target is closer than 10 meters, it can even cause permanent damage and death. But other than that, if used correctly against a crowd of rioters, for example, it can quickly and effectively disable a group of people without causing any permanent damage. That's exactly what a non-lethal weapon should do. Number 2. Armor 100 This non-lethal weapon can be very effective in certain situations. It's designed more for law enforcement and home defense. The Armor 100 is basically a beanbag shotgun. It's a point-and-shoot weapon that fires a non-lethal projectile at the target. It's powerful enough to knock someone off their feet and cause significant pain, but won't actually do any permanent damage. So if a madman comes at you with maybe a knife or a bat, this weapon can certainly be useful. But I wouldn't bring it with me to a gunfight. Number 1. Phaser Probably the coolest sounding weapon on this list is also truly the most unique. This weapon uses the power of light. Well, to be more specific, it's actually a laser gun. It looks like something straight out of a sci-fi film, but how it works is a bit different to what you might expect. It fires out a non-lethal laser designed to be targeted onto someone's eyes. When the laser hits someone's eyes, it temporarily blinds them and disables them. A lot of technology is crammed into this laser gun to ensure that the laser itself doesn't cause permanent damage. After all, as a non-lethal weapon, blinding someone for life would be the exact opposite. It has something called a laser range finder, which precisely calculates the exact strength the laser needs to be at in order to just temporarily blind the target. Thank you for watching, do make sure to turn on channel notifications and follow me on Instagram, Twitter and Snapchat. All details are on screen and in the description below. Also let me know what kind of videos you'd like to see next. I do read all comments and I'm always open to suggestions. Once again, thank you for watching and until next time, feed your mind.